Martin.com representing and partially sponsoring this big question. <laughs> I represent Will Sork, gentlemen of the board. Uh, this past Friday, uh, I'm a big Lucha Libre fan, and I had to experience the match between Atlantis and La Sombra, where Atlantis, a uh, 52-year-old, unmasked an up-and-coming amazing wrestler, La Sombra. Now, uh, in Mexico, if, you, if you're a fan of uh, Lucha Underground, you, you'll notice that the masks are a big thing. I, it's something that can change your career if you lose it. And because of that, my whole Friday night was, was doomed. I was pissed off at the world because Atlantis have, be, have won. So uh, the big question of this week is, what booking decision could make you go crazy, pissed off, infuriated from your, uh, the, the promotions that you follow? Recently? Yeah, so, something uh, uh, something that's like in current storylines. Mm-hmm. What's the direction that could happen that would just make you go crazy? I get really mad when old guys get the belt mm-hmm. in indies. Like, like, um, and this is this is a broad problem. This is a broad problem um, where it's like you know you have a lot of young guys and you're just like, why did that dude that can barely go and uh and uh yeah that that just to no end you know i understand getting the local guy you know who's going to stick around uh especially when it comes to an indian booking and scheduling but um yeah that there's that just kind of bothers me and i feel like that slows down an entire promotion when 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 that happens i'm just gonna leave that there who's next i got one Okay. Two scenarios. If Mojo Raleigh and Zack Ryder win the Dusty Rhodes Tag Team Tournament, or sticking with NXT, if Dana Brooke ever becomes the women's champion in NXT, Oof. you will you you will hear me scream from the rooftops because don't like either one of those. Oh, Bobby, you should join us at the midweek board because. There, there's a current debate between Dana Brooke and Bailey uh, fanatics. What? <laughs> Who's a Dana Brooke fanatic out of you guys? Guilty. What? <laughs> what? She talks through her nose. I love this. We didn't real. I didn't realize this 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 distinction. See, you should listen to the other podcast more, Bobby. I know. Oh. She does more gonna, than just that awkward gonna, move. Tap Tony on the head. So, so, so you're you're disagreeing with my notion that 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 Brooke is the um 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 women's Lex Luger. No, I I think she is, but uh, but I love her. I, I can't wait for her to be thrown Bailey. Lex Luger now. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! That's sad. <laughs> no, no. I don't know. What about you, Wheels? You got an answer? Wow. <laughs> I, honestly, I kind of, in a strange way, agree with Sorg. Because Sorg and I have had this conversation many times. And it's just like, and I understand certain reasons why older people or the vets get championships. But, honestly, let, if there's a val- valid young talent that can go and do it that's good on a mic on talent and everything let that person have it because nobody wants to see an old man in a ring anymore i mean look at sting did we all really want to see sting as champion sunday night i kind of did did I would like to see him. Sunday night. <laughs> I think Sting well, would have fallen into that uh, previous uh, answer that I had to this question. Yeah. 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 But just because he's never been, though. Mm-hmm. But it would be a notch in his belt. I've no only, I only would have found it acceptable if he got the title and immediately lost to the Sheamus. No. Well, yeah. I would be okay. <laughs> come, well, come on. Sheamus can actually do something. You <laughs> yeah. know? And it's not going to be Bobby. Don't worry. It's not 
it wouldn't have been, oh, Seamus cashed in on Sting and won the belt. Oh, here comes Randy Orton. Don't yeah. worry about that. We wouldn't have had that. It's a shameful thing. Uh, well, for her. I miss that song. <laughs> that was <laughs> the best thing about Seamus, and they took it away. <laughs> Garza, I, Garza, did you answer your own question here? Uh, well, I mean, my previous one was uh, the unmasking of someone really young okay. and up and coming. 